The term nirvana is the Buddhist term for enlightenment. It's not a band from Seattle. Well, not, not the same as the band from Seattle. So um, the term for enlightenment for Hinduism was moksha. In Buddhism, it's nirvana. But they are more or less equivalent. In both cases, once someone achieves enlightenment, they are free from the cycle of rebirth. However, someone who has become enlightened may choose to be reborn um, to come back to the earth to serve as a teacher for other people. A couple of different aspects of Buddhism. Over time, Buddhism breaks off into various sects or different groups. Um, Mahayana Buddhists, my understanding of this, is that for the Mahayana Buddhists, um, they believed that a person could achieve enlightenment, that they could seek enlightenment and follow the Buddhist religion while leading a normal life. However, the Theravada Buddhists believed that you pretty much had to follow the example of Buddha to the letter um, to basically shun the world to enter a monastery and to spend a life in prayer. Um, so two very different approaches to Buddhism. And of course today, <coughs> people all over the world follow various different Buddhist teachers. So there are lots of variations on how the religion is practiced depending on where you are and what particular teacher you follow. Mm 